Okay, next game. Uh, let's play e3. Okay, so I'm down four pieces, which is actually more than a queen here. Play queen e2, maybe e4. Do a pre-move. Take. Maybe rook d1. I'm gonna need to attack somehow. Let's play like queen g4. Sounds like clown sound. Indeed. Oh, there's no mate! Oh! 97 is such a bad move, but there's no checkmate. Oh, so sad, so sad, so sad. Oh, but he blunders it. Wee, okay, next game. Oh, uh, this is not odds. I just, you better put my time at 30 seconds. This is not odds at all. This is not odds at all, actually. This is hard. This is not odds at all. Um, yeah, this is better. This is a uh, interesting odds, but this, this 11 is 1979. So, uh, not, not bad at any rate. Thank you, Arnie HCFC, for the six month resub. Um, I'll do a rematch, maybe. Maybe that'll restart it. Thank you, uh, Judas Goat, for the two month resub. Thank you so much. Um, FM Ali Rasbot says, how can we play odds chess? Okay, okay, so I'll play knight three, knight f2. Okay, I need 30 seconds again. Um, Okay, this is weird. I guess he's not here. Okay, so... Okay, so we'll keep moving on then with the queue and whoever's next. I'll play whoever's next. Okay, um, I am down what here? I am down queen for a rook. This doesn't look like odds either. I, I think I'm just winning, right? I've got a rook and a pawn for a queen. Oh, mama mia, this is just winning for me. This isn't odds, this is just plus minus, I bet. Maybe not plus minus, but I bet the computer doesn't say this is like much better for black. If you, if you turn on uh, Leela or whichever engine, I bet it says uh, that this is like, probably like minus 0.5 maybe, maybe if that. I bet, I bet black's not even better here, actually. So I've got a rook and a pawn for a queen. I'm gonna get some very fast attack, quick development. <coughs> I mean, this looks really, really good for me. <clears throat> Maybe not though, cause he can take bishop d4 and queen c3. Let's play bishop d4, queen c3. Maybe, no, I'm I miss playing this. I let him out, I let him off the, oh, oh, whoops, I've got 30 seconds. Oh, geez, I better move fast. Oops, okay, let's go a3. Okay, I've got to move really, really fast.
I've got to move really, really fast here. Okay. Uh. Ah, such a bad blunder. I mean, I've also got no time here. Yeah, there's there's no way I can win. I mean, if I, I can't win this, this one I'm going to lose. Uh, uh, thank you. I'll, uh, uh, let's go D7. Pick. Um... Oh, maybe I can win this. Okay, this is gonna be really, really tight. Okay. Checkmate, there we go. All right. That was pretty, pretty crazy. That was really kind of insane. Okay, this game I have bad odds. I'm down a rook and a knight and a pawn. Pretty, pretty rough. Play E3. This one's gonna be pretty rough. This is not gonna be easy. Try to attack with a tribe. Maybe play C4, kick the knight away. Kick the knight again. D4 maybe. Oh, I meant D4, ack. Okay, let's go D4. Whoa, that's a free piece. Okay, so I'm only down one rook, so it's starting to get better. Let's take. Play queen g7, hit the rook, threaten checkmate. Um, let's play knight d2 maybe. Checkmate. All right, next game. If rook g7, by the way, I'd rook h8 mate. <clears throat> Yeah, bishop takes d4 was not a good move at all. All right, so we're waiting for the next game to start. Should be starting pretty soon, I would think. All right, looks like I'm gonna be playing John Davis pretty soon too. Uh, Telemann says, do I think Toronto will beat Golden State? I hope they beat Golden State. I mean, again, I'm not optimistic, realistically, but I would love to see that happen. 
I mean, I'm getting tired of seeing the, the Warriors win every year or the stacked team, so hopefully uh, somebody beats them. All right, I'm playing John Davis. Uh, okay, let's play D4. Okay, so um, play knight f3. Maybe knight g3 or knight d3. I guess I'll play knight g3. Just try to keep it super solid with the uh, with the knights. Knight e4. He's got like queen f4. I can actually take right because I protect b2. Let's play knight e4. Hit the bishop. I feel like in general you want to exchange bishops early if you can. Oh, I blundered c2. But I've got knight c3, and the queen's kind of a little bit iffy. Um, okay, please queen of trial. Let's hit the knight, hit the queen again, another tempo. Probably e4 next move. Um, let's play e4, knight e3, knight e3, knight c3, c4, e5, c5. Let's hit the queen again. Hit the queen again. Play knight c3, maybe e5, knight e4. Um, don't really like e5 because you can build a center, central point somewhere with f6, e5, or d5. But now I get knight d4. Nice big jumbo clump here in the center. Let's play knight e2. Um, try to keep these, these knights all like compact, all really tight and together here. Um, okay, I've got knight c5 maybe. I can also I'm gonna play h4, h5, h6. Maybe c3 to solidify everything here. Got to keep all the knights held together. This is like this is like 300, where like blacks out all these extra pieces, but I've got all these knights in this tight space. Just got to keep the knights and the formation really, really tight, and then I can like defeat him hopefully eventually. Play knight d2 and f4 again. This 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 really is like ancient military strategy. Bunch of knights, keep everything really tight and close together. And if I do that, don't let him break through with the heavy 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 pieces. Um, that's a free pawn. Again, everything is everything is close. Um, just keep all these knights really, really tight and compact here. Don't let him ever break through. If he breaks through, I lose. So let's just keep it really, really tight here. Like try to put the knight on d4 at some point. Let's re re reroute this knight. Keep all the knights really, really tight. Everything really, really close together here. Um, if I take and go knight b4, he can take maybe. I don't see a breakthrough, so I'll play knight b4. Phalanx is the right term? It is indeed. Oh, I blundered. If I take he has queen d3. Oh, shoot. I blundered. I still am okay, though, I think, because I've got knight c2 here. Again, I'm trying to keep the knights, keep the formation solid here. Um, <laughs> dude, the squeaky noises. Yeah, I'm, it's intentional, you guys. Okay, g5, I'll take. Queen g6, maybe I play g3. As long as I don't let him break through. Wow, that's an interesting move. Okay, I'll just take. I can play knight f3, maybe? Yeah, again, the knights are very, very compact here. Everything's sort of controlling the right squares. Knight g5. Again, no a3 break. I just can't let him break through. Okay, king g6 i can take i can even play knight a3 i think i'm just gonna sidestep with king f2 and put the knight on e3 or a3 um but should be winning here eventually let's go knight e3 i'm gonna go knight e6 f5 he's got queen b1 i guess but okay i take Hit the rook. Knights are still very compact here. Let's just go back. Knight f5 is a threat. Knight g3 is a threat too. Okay, there's fork number one. Check. Let's try to get a three knights mate here. Maybe knight e6. I don't know if I had a mate. I was trying to find a mate here, but um, but close enough. Okay, we're going to play this position again. I'll castle like I have the last two times. Okay, 
Okay, so that's an interesting sack. Let's play queen e2 of takes. I'll take with the bishop. Playing against knights is very hard. Um, I mean, I played against knights against uh, the computer, and I got a winning position, but I still wasn't able to convert. So, like, the knights, is, knights and bishops are generally pretty... Wow, this guy is very sack-happy. Let's play queen f2. Hit the pawn in f7. Uh, check, check, and for extra good measure, let's take. The checkmate. Did I start with a handicap? Why am I behind in material? Yes, I did start with a handicap. Okay, um, okay, so I'm playing again with four or three piece odds here. Play c3, maybe d4. Take. Could I win slower? Could I win slower? Is what Chess Bay is saying. Too damn fast, too damn fast. Sorry, Chess Bay. What to do? What to do? Play queen e2. Play rook d1. Well, let's play bishop c2. Try to keep, uh, Keep the position complicated for a while. Queen f2. Play bishop d3 back. I don't know if this does anything. Bishop f1. Let's play g4, maybe g5, h4. Play h3. If e5, maybe g5, f4. This is pretty, pretty bad for me. What odds do I give at 2504? Maybe just time odds. Maybe just regular time odds. 3-1 or something. Or 3-30. Whoa! Thank you, Fajanky, Fajankly, for gifting 50 subs to community. Thank you so much, Mr. Fajank Fajankly. Thank you so much for the 50 gifted subs. Wow. Thank you so much. Uh, let's play Queen G3 and takes. Thank you to everybody um, who is now part of the community. Thank you so much, uh, Fajank. Fajank, Fajankly. I, I'm sure that's not that's not uh, American English. I'm sure I'm butchering it completely, but thank you nonetheless. Um, I want to go Bishop H3. This isn't going to go well. Let's play. Thank you, Vian Dante, for subscribing with Twitch Prime. Um, this guy is playing very, very solidly so far. Very solidly. Bishop e6 is coming, rook e3 is coming. Let's take the rook. Rook e8 was a bad move. Now I'm still down material, but it's uh it's not as uh, as easy for black to play. Let's just go rook e3, more pressure on the pawn, maybe a4, c4, try to break the break the center, put more pressure on this pawn on e6 here. Let's go b3. <laughs> Probably c4 takes next move, maybe queen b8 at some point. Time odds is boring. I mean, I can play the 2500 with all knights if you guys think that's reasonable. Thank you, Jerbuckeye, for subscribing with tier 1 sub. I mean, because I feel like knights is the hardest one to win objectively. Go rook f1, hit the queen. Maybe rook f3, put pressure on the knight, queen b8 at some point. Again, I'm still worse because I've got this one weakness that he can easily attack. Um, play rook f2. <clears throat> Maybe rook e2. All knights? Yeah, I would say all knights is probably the best odds other than just flat out time odds. Uh, maybe rook e3 is fine. Queen f3, hit the pawn on d5 here. Oh, that's a good move. Maybe just rook e2, trade. Uh, check. 
Protect the pawn. Um, <clears throat> threat and check on e6 here. Hit the knight on c6. Free knight. Play rook c7. <laughs> A row full of sounds. WTF. WTF indeed. Indeed. <laughs> Alright, that's the end of the game. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Let's go D3. Um, okay, I'm giving him one. I'm giving him like a one, two, three, four, five, and six. So I'm giving him six tempo odds, six six moves. Play H3. <laughs> G3. Let's play A3. Um, I guess I'll play Bishop G2. 92. Play b3 maybe. He's got three pawn breaks, which should be two. Maybe I'll play a4. Okay, c4. I'll just play knight d2. Trade, trade. It's gonna slide over with my king to h2. I guess um, c3 is still not a threat, so I'll take. Okay, queen c2 is a serious problem. Um, oh, bishop c3, rook c3. Oh, let's play rook b1, queen d3, bishop f1, maybe. Maybe. Um, yeah, probably I should play bishop f1. I mean, I, okay, he goes queen c2 back. I can't really trade. Um, play bishop g2. Not a good position. Pretty ugly. Okay, so I'll trade and play rook d1. Um, I guess bishop f1, support the knight. Someone says tiger is killing it there. Okay, let's trade. Um, I guess I'll just play g4. If rook b8, maybe bishop a1, knight b1. Still pretty ugly. Knight e4, just king g1, I think is fine. Maybe I play knight c3 next move, try to exchange some knights. I can take it into draw, I can play knight c3 to try and win. Let's try to win. If I take knight h4, knight c3, Knight f3, king g2, knight f4, king g1, knight f3 is just a draw, so let's try to win. Um, obviously, he'll take on g4. He takes on a3, but now I think I can take and grab both pawns. I'll grab d5, a central pawn's more valuable than a pawn on the rim. Goes bishop f8, I can't take some knight f3 check. Um, ooh, this is tricky. Twicky, twicky, twicky. Um, don't really like, I'll go e4, knight e3, I guess. Hit the rook. Um, c4, maybe. Um, how do I want to do this? I guess I'll just go bishop c3. King g2. I'll play bishop c4. King g3 doesn't make sense. Rook d2 doesn't look right. Um, if I trade bishop c4, no good. Um, I guess I'll just play rook b1, try to put the rook on b8 here. Thank you, Applejam255, for the three month uh, resub. Thank you so much. Let's just trade, take. He's gonna go a2, rook b8. I can cover the, I cover the a1 square here, which is important. Um, b2, I guess I'll play rook a8. This way there's no uh, a1 idea. 
Bishop c3, bishop b4 is a huge threat now. Um, I, oh no, I don't know bishop b4 because he's got a, a one queen. New, um, I guess I'll go h6 just to take. Now I've got three pawns. I should just be winning. Thank you. Um, thank you, Reezy Chess, for subscribing to the tier one sub. Let's make a uh, check. Let's make a check. Let's make a takes. Check. Check. <laughs> Derek at six. Um. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay, next game, Stashy TV playing with four piece odds this time. Let's play E3. Castle, maybe play D4 and takes. Um, whoa, F6 is not ideal. Let's take. Um, play D5, hit the knight. <laughs> F4, hit the knight again. Good morning, Hikaru. Will you finish the 3000 bullet speed run? That's a check to pick up the knight. Um, I will at some point, not right, not the second, but I will. Play d6. Take the pawn. That's checkmate. <laughs> uh, too good, too good, too good. Play bishop c3, hit the pawn on g7. Every time so far, the person's hung the pawn on g7, so let's see if it happens again. Oh, we saw it! Shucks. Okay, let's try to hit him the other way. Let's hit this pawn. Um, <clears throat> okay, let's play bishop b3, hit the pawn on a7. Maybe bishop d4, bishop... Okay, that's the first mistake. That's a free pawn. Um, maybe just bishop b3, bishop. Okay, let's play bishop b3. Oh, I had bishop b6 hitting the queen. That was probably better. Okay, um, I don't have a way to trap the queen, but let's go bishop b6. Bishop g3, maybe hit the bishop this way, or the knight this way. Bishop b5, bishop d3. Play bishop e5, try to put pressure on this diagonal as well. Maybe bishop d3 to put more pressure on this diagonal too. Okay, play c5, um, that's a good move. Actually, that's a free pawn, right? I can take. Take some bishop h7, <laughs> next move. Um, let's take the pawn. Take the rook. If c4, just like bishop c2 or bishop d1. Let's go bishop d1. So, because on bishop c2, there was knight before hitting the bishop. So, I want the bishop on d1. I really wish I had a rook to mate him on g8 here. I don't have a rook, but oh well. Um, this guy's playing this pretty well. This guy's playing playing this one uh, quite well. 
Go bishop d4, hit the knight again. Knight d3, I just take. Okay, rook a6, let's play bishop c5, maybe bishop d2. Problem is, he has no real weaknesses here in the position with this pawn structure, so it's going to be hard to win. Okay, queen c6, let's play bishop d2, maybe bishop f1 to collect. Probably I'm going to try to play this like I did with the knights and bring all my bishops back. Um, let's go bishop f2 maybe. Oh, that was a rook on a4 that was hanging. Whoops, I missed that. Oh, whoops. Let's go bishop f1, try to win the uh, pawn here. I have a bishop on f3 that supports d1. Take. Let's go bishop h5, try to... Um, Maybe bring my bishops. Now I've got the triple bishops, which I think somebody was. Play bishop h7, bishop g8. <clears throat> That's a pawn. Oh, shoot. Oh, I have to go bishop d1, bishop e3. Let's just block this way. Um. Uh, all right, next game. Uh, Krasbet says amazing sound effects. You can tell this is a serious chess player here. Uh, all right, so as I pointed out before with these odds, these odds I don't think are really odds. So if you could set my clock to 30 seconds, please. Um, that would be better. 30 seconds, one minute's, one minute's not low enough, 30 seconds. Oh, already set to one? Okay, so be it. The free piece. Let's just take again. Play bishop g5. Yeah, I mean, I feel like when you give up these pawns in general, it's a big edge, and this guy's also 1187, so I feel like I'm just trying to be fair here. Um... Oh, you... oh, it was reset to 20 seconds, okay. Here we go, 20 seconds. Here we go. Okay, queen h4. Let's go queen h4. Free move knight d5. Um, threatening to take and mate. Bishop f5 is probably... Okay, takes. All right, there we go. 